We're going to start by watching The Keeper's Diary, a biohazard story. This is a fan film that I've been waiting for to come out. Came out today. So uh, let's take a look here. It's a bit loud. I'm going to turn that down just a little. There we go. The Keeper's Diary, a biohazard story. <laughs> it caught me off guard. <laughs> Battle not with monsters, lest you become a monster and you gaze in the abyss, the abyss gazes into you. Starting off with a Nietzsche quote. Ballsy. <laughs> Ow. I wonder where this was shot. I didn't actually keep up with like any of the development stuff at all. I just wanted to see it when it came out. That feeling when the vibe and tone is immediately ex way better than the actual movies. Thanks for... Do, are my alerts off? Thanks for the resub. I'll look into that in a second. Is that a queen poster? And a Jennifer Aniston poster? Oh, wow. Classic. May 9th, 1998. Nice, okay. Played poker tonight with Scott and Elias from security. Yo. And Steve from research. over aces <laughs> it's four aces no way hey what can i say steve was the big winner 
but I think he was cheating. Sorry. Scumbag. So far, this is really good. So in case, in case you weren't sure what's going on here, there's a file in the original Resident Evil. That's the Keeper's Diary. But it's kind of the most infamous one. It's the one that ends. It's the one that showcases like a dude turning into a zombie slowly and like the entries get more and more twisted, basically. And then the final one is just itchy tasty. It's kind of like the meme one or whatever. They made a full fan film based around that. So the voiceover you're hearing is him writing the letter or the diary, 10th, I guess. 1998. Just in case you weren't sure what's going on. Assigned me to take care of a new creature. Commence with the procedure. That's obviously Wesker. Looks like a skinned gorilla. Feeding and Oh man. Live animals. Those uh the menu sounds. I think from Resident Evil 2 specifically. Yeah, good sound effects. A lot of fake blood. When I threw in a pig, the creature seemed to play with it. The <laughs> thing's pretty Turned silly looking, legs. but... Pulling out I like it before it actually started eating. Good. Very good. Seal it off. May eleventh, nineteen ninety eight. At around five AM. Scott woke me up. Scared the shit out of me, too. Hey, Scott, open up. Let me in. Are we at war? He was wearing a protective suit. There's been an accident in the lab. I need you to wear this from now on. Do you understand? Wait, what? He handed me another one and told me to put it on. Said there'd been an accident in the basement lab. Is everything okay? I'm not sure. But if anyone asks, you didn't get that from me. I just knew something like this would happen. Those bastards in research never sleep. Even on holiday. I feel like that room's in 12th, 1998. I've been wearing the damn spacesuit since yesterday. My skin's getting grimy and it feels itchy all over. Yo, thanks for gifting us up. Look at me funny. Gotta find out why the alerts aren't working properly. I did not defeat him today. Screw him. May 13th, 1998. Oh. I went to the infirmary because my back is all swollen. It feels itchy. Looks like scarring. They put a big bandage on it and told me I didn't need to wear the suit anymore. If you keep scratching it, it's going to keep getting worse. Give it some time to heal. You're going to take this twice a day. You'll notice it start to get better. And this is for the pain.
Aqua Cure and Safspin. Very cool. Those are uh, drugs that they advertise in Resident Evil 3. One of which is the uh, RNG code for one of the May locked 14th, doors. May 14th, 1998. And what's the other one? Adravil? I think Adravil is the third one. Found another big blister on my foot this morning. Gross. <laughs> so gross. Uh. I ended up dragging my foot all the way to the dog's pen. They were quiet all day, which is weird. Then I realized some of them had escaped. Uh, maybe this is their way of getting back at me for not feeding them the last three days. If anybody finds out, I'll have my head handed to me. not safe out here. Go back to your room. Look, sir. There's another one. I'm sure it'll be fine. This is fine. Since 1998, rumors going around that a researcher who tried to escape the estate last night was shot. My entire body feels hot, itchy, and I'm sweating all the time now. Oh. I scratched the swelling on my arm, and a, a piece of rotten flesh dropped off. What the hell's happening to me? Fever gone, but itchy. Today, <laughs> hungry. And eat doggy food. Uh oh. Itchy. Itchy. Hey, it's your buddy, Scott. Scott came. Buddy, you don't look so good. You're gonna need to come with me, okay? <laughs> Ugly face. Killed him. <laughs> the zombie just typing itchy tasty. I was hoping we would see it. It's so stupid. Poor bastard. That was actually really, really cool. I gotta give it to him. That was fucking awesome. I mean, it was only like a 20 minute little basic Easter egg thing, but holy crap. The vibe was so, so on. What a cool fan project. Why is this so long? Oh, there's a bunch of stuff in here. Cool. Keep watching here. I'm really glad that Capcom didn't make them pull the plug on this. Uh, 
I'm excited to see what the other few minutes here is. Other five minutes. Is that Farrah Fawcett or Cindy Crawford? I can't remember. It was one of them. That's a classic 90s uh, poster, though. Weirdly surprised at how decent the, uh, the hunter looks silly, but in a way that I thought was really cool. <laughs> like, I'm glad that it looked like Regina, the shitty old nine. access to the control room. Well, that was quick. The shitty old, like, 90s, uh, back there. Piece of cake. Leave it to me. Look. Regina, any sign of Kirk? I'm afraid not, sir. Regina, He's huh? sweeping the area. He can't be far. <sighs> All right. These monitors ought to spill the secrets on Kirk's location. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Who is the brainiest of them all? Wait. What is it? You're not alone. I know, Crisis. I was wondering if when they said Regina, like Dino Crisis? Yeah, the third energy crisis. Wow. <laughs> Man, good for them. Good for them just going for it. I mean, why not, right? Yeah, that was really, really cool. Who did he play? Okay. So the keeper. Steve from I don't know if you recognize him, the keeper. But that is actually let me see if I can find a picture of him. The keeper in this game. Or in this show this short movie or whatever is why don't just open the fucking image don't open the thing uh open image in new tab is the original chris redfield <laughs> and the fmv from the original game he's he's the one they got to play the uh keeper in this